A manual of acupuncture multimedia DVD-ROM is the exciting new tool for acupuncture students and practitioners alike, packed with innovative features that will help you improve your knowledge. You can view and search the entire contents of a manual of acupuncture, view pop-up body area illustrations, hear Chinese pronunciations of the point names, view high quality videos showing how to locate and needle every point in the manual, with Chu Chu, Argentestine 11. Use the comprehensive self-testing modules to challenge yourself and revise points and locations in numerous ways. Locate points manually on illustrations from the manual. Test groups of points by body area. Test channel pathways. Point classifications. And Chinese point names. Keep your own notes. Flag problem points for extra practice. Custom build your own tests. And keep track of your progress by viewing all of your statistics. Whether you're learning the points for the first time or refreshing your knowledge, a manual of acupuncture multimedia DVD-ROM is an essential resource. Wenliu, large intestine 7, is located 5 tsun proximal to the Yangshi, large intestine 5, on the line connecting Yangshi, large intestine 5, with Chu Chu, large intestine 11. 1. Locate with the elbow flexed and with the radial side of the arm upwards. 2. Divide the distance between Yangshi, large intestine 5, and Chu Chu, large intestine 11, into two equal parts. Then locate Wen Liu, large intestine 7, one tsun distal to this midpoint. Transverse oblique insertion, 0.5 to 1 tsun. Yun Men Lung 2 is located on the anterolateral aspect of the chest, below the lateral extremity of the clavicle, 6 tsun lateral to the midline, in the center of the hollow of the deltopectoral triangle. Ask the patient to extend their hand forwards whilst you apply resistance to their hand, in order to emphasize the deltopectoral triangle, and locate Yun Men Lung 2 at its center. Transverse oblique insertion, 0.5 to 1 tsun. Caution. Deep perpendicular or oblique insertion carries a substantial risk of causing a pneumothorax. First locate the lumbosacral junction and the sacrococcygeal hiatus at the midline. Divide this line into five equal spaces using the four fingertips of one hand. Each fingertip should then lie on one of the four sacral spinous processes which are sometimes palpable. The foramina lie lateral to the processes, at the same level, and at approximately half the distance, i.e. 0.75 tsun, between the midline and the bladder back shoe point line. Note that the line of the sacral foramina runs slightly towards the midline as it descends. Note also that the foramina may be palpable in some patients, and that pressure applied to them may induce a de chi sensation, slight tingling, etc. The second sacral foramen lies at approximately the midpoint of a line drawn between the posterior superior iliac spine and the sacrococcygeal hiatus.